Vienna Boo, it's Mommy. I was thinking about you and I thought it would be fun if before you went to bed tonight, we read a bedtime story together. So Mommy's still on trek. Mommy's running through the mountains and I hope you're having fun with your cousins, with Sophie and Lena and Mara and baby John and being a good listener. But I want to say hi really quick and say that I love you and let's read a book together before you go to bed, okay? Okay, we're going to read the Big Leaf Pile with Clifford and his friends. Ready? Let's see, I'm opening the book. You like this book, huh? Okay, here we go. There's Clifford, see? It was a beautiful fall day on Birdwell Island. Cleo, Clifford, and T-Bone were making leaf piles. If you want your cousins to read with us too, that would be really fun. Cleo finished her pile of leaves they were red, yellow, orange, gold, and brown. Do you see all those colors in that pile? Red, yellow, orange, gold, and brown. Let's turn the page. Okay. She counted one, two, three, and jumped in. Woohoo! Clifford finished his pile of leaves. They were red, yellow, orange, gold, and brown too. Look at all those colors. Here we go. Turn the page. He counted one, two, three, and jumped in. Crash! T-Bone's pile was not finished yet. T-Bone's pile had only brown leaves. Brown leaves make a nice, loud sound crunch. Let's see what happens with T-Bone's pile. I need more leaves, T-Bone said. I will help, said Clifford. I will help too, said Cleo. And they did. Look, they're all helping to make T-Bone's brown crunchy leaf pile. Okay, T-Bone's pile of leaves was ready, but T-Bone had to go home. I will watch your leaves, said Clifford. They will be safe with me, I promise. Did you hear Daddy start his motorcycle? I hear Daddy's motorcycle outside. You are good friends, said T-Bone, and a happy T-Bone trotted off to go on his walk. Clifford watched the pile of leaves. He watched and watched some more. This is a very nice leaf pile, he said. I can't wait to hear its loud sound. We could jump in carefully if we don't mess it up, said Cleo. Hmm, is that a good idea? Yes, we could, said Clifford. Then let's jump, said Cleo. Cleo and Clifford ran to the pile and jumped in with a big crunch. Look at that crunch. The wind blew, the leaves flew, a strong wind blew them everywhere. Oh no, said Clifford. You can help me turn the page, ready? Clifford and Cleo chased T-Bone's leaf. One leaf was on a weather vane, way up there on top of a house. Another leaf was under the mail truck. Good thing Clifford's strong enough to lift it up. Cleo and Clifford found a leaf on a swing in a playground. Do you see it? They found a leaf on some french fries. Ah, that poor lady. Whoa! Cleo and Clifford found every leaf, every one of the missing leaves. Even this one that's falling into the ocean. He caught it just in time. This is a great leaf pile, said Clifford. I can't wait to hear the noise it makes, said Cleo. We'll have to imagine the noise it makes. Because we can't hear it in the book, but we can see the pictures. We could jump in, Clifford said. But we won't, they said together. T-Bone came back. His pile looked even bigger and better than before. Thank you for watching my leaves, he said to Clifford. I want you to be the first to jump in. Um, we must tell you the truth, 
We already jumped into your pile. All your leaves flew away, Clifford said. But Cleo and I got them back. I'm sorry, T-Bone. He told the truth, huh? And he said he was sorry. And he fixed his mistake. I'm glad you told me the truth, said T-Bone. I still want you to jump in first. So Clifford jumped in with a big crunch. Crunch, 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 crunch. Then Cleo and T-Bone jumped in. Crunch, crunch! Woohoo! Woohoo! That's your bedtime story for tonight. I hope you're having lots of fun. Mommy misses you and I can't wait to see you in just a couple of days. Okay, so here's a big kiss. I love you. Have a good night and have sweet dreams. Don't forget to say your prayers and brush your teeth. I love you, Nunnerbug. I'll see you in just a couple days. Bye-bye.